a noticeably, visibly, desperate, delusional, detached, dangerous, Donald Trump released a video to his True Social account. Deranged, sorry, I have to include that. Uh, he released a video to his True Social account begging, pleading for the Republicans in Congress to once again weaponize their power that they have to defend him in some way, to step in, to interfere with his accountability legally that he's possibly experiencing now based on his seemingly clear violations of the law. And he's saying, please, Republicans, while you're in Washington complaining about the federal government being weaponized, can you please use your role in the federal government, weaponize it to protect me? Take a look. Congress, if you will, please investigate the political witch hunts against me currently being brought by the corrupt DOJ and FBI, who are totally out of control. They don't go after Biden with all of his corruption, the most corrupt president in history. False. But they keep coming after me from the day I came down the escalator, all failures. Hmm. You'll notice he never addresses the E word. He'll stay vague, but he won't dive into the evidence. He won't explain how the evidence against him is illegitimate and the evidence or lack thereof is somehow actually present against Joe Biden. And separate from his baseless accusations against Joe Biden and the right wing's baseless accusations against Joe Biden, why even then are you saying that Trump shouldn't be held accountable for his violations of the law? Even that argument doesn't make sense. So when you take into consideration that what they're saying Biden did, he didn't do, or at least they haven't been able to prove it, then it's particularly absurd that they're saying Trump shouldn't be held accountable and they won't address any of them, the details of, for example, the classified documents indictment. Because if you do that, it becomes clear that Trump committed crime. It seems very, very clear. And if indeed we live in a country as they say, or they did previously, they wanted us to of law and order and no one's above the law, then Trump should be held accountable for that under the law. He continued on True Social saying, so let's get this straight. The Democrat slime balls in Congress, hmm, then headed by crazy Nancy Pelosi, impeached me over a perfect phone call I won and are now indicting me over their continuing illegal and long running witch hunt. But crooked Joe Biden, who has stolen and extorted millions of dollars, that's just not true, has not been proven, won't be impeached or indicted by a very kind, friendly and politically correct Republican Congress. Notice how strange that is. The reason I pause after indicted, he's saying Congress should indict Biden. Eh? Does he know how Congress works? Congress can't indict people. Gee, that seems very fair to me. Make America great again, Trump ends it. So the message from Trump is House Republicans should indict Biden and impeach him. Now, they're not going to indict him, but it does seem like as we see so often, they are falling in line with what Trump's, uh, Trump wants, and they are starting impeachment inquiries or talking about it and saying that it's time to prepare for impeachment of Biden. Again, based on accusations, we've so thoroughly gone through and explained in the past why they're very, very illegitimate against President Biden from Republicans. But they're ready to impeach him or at least start that discussion. And Marjorie Green was proudly bragging about how she started that discussion the day after Biden got into office because she's serious. This isn't just a political distraction. This is serious. And that's why I wanted to impeach a president the day after the first full day of his <laughs> presidency. Hmm. Um, but this most importantly, absolutely highlights how Trump uses those who do have positions of power right now, like we talked about, I think it was yesterday, to help his own campaign work in his political interests. And now House Republicans will do what he's saying. We're going to go after Biden more and more and more as we possibly can to help Trump politically. And that's pretty wild and shouldn't be how our leaders uh, within these positions of power act. Thank you so much for watching. If you want to be a part of what makes this show possible, plus get access to the full video version of the show hours before all the clips are able to be uploaded to the YouTube channel, plus get the bonus show on the weekends, you can do so by going to LukeBeasleyShow.com slash membership. That's LukeBeasleyShow.com slash membership, and there's a link in the description.